Train to Validate is the acronym of Professional Training for Easy to Read Validators and Facilitators. This project, led by Planning to Ciudad Madrid, is funded by the European Commission. This project will be developed in the next three years until August 2023. The aim of this project is to develop a certified training program for easy to read validators and facilitators. These both positions are very relevant in this to read. Validators are people who assess and test the easy to read texts and facilitators are people who support validators in their role. Trying to validate is organized in six intellectual outputs or expected results. The first one is a common methodological framework. In this common methodological framework, we are going to develop a survey to obtain and gather information about the development of validators and facilitators across Europe. From the information that we can gather and collect from the survey, then we are going to build the following steps or respective results. The second result is skills cards for both positions, validators and facilitators. These skills cards will explain the abilities that both positions will have to reach at the end of the process. The third result is a curriculum expressed in modules and credits, as it is usual in the European studies. The fourth and five results are connected because the project will, be, uh, will develop open educational resources and we will going to test them because we are also produce the open resources and tools for teachers in order to teach these uh, positions, these courses, for uh, these programs for validators mainly. And finally, we are going to develop a result focus in the possibilities to obtain an official certification for validators and facilitators. The Trying to Validate project partners have perceived the increasing production of easy-to-read publications across Europe. That's why we consider that this collaboration will be very helpful to consolidate the training for validators and facilitators and also consolidate their positions as real employment possibilities. Mainly, validator is a position in which people with intellectual disabilities or even with reading difficulties are very involved because both of them are not only beneficiaries of easy to read, but also participants in this process. So, consolidating the position of validator will show the contribution of both groups to the whole society. Seven organizations are taking part in the Train to Validate European project. Plenic de Madrid from Spain is leading the project and has a long experience supporting people in, with intellectual disabilities and producing easy to read texts. Two other non-profit organizations are part of this consortium. Sabotrisa from Slovenia is working for a long time with people with intellectual disabilities and also creating easy to read texts. Fundatia Profesional from Romania has a long experience in projects supporting people with risk of social exclusion. Three universities are also part of this partnership. SDI Munich, SSML PISA and the Polytechnic University of Timisoara in Romania. All of them have a long experience in accessibility communication and translation. Finally, the European Association ECQA from Austria 
has experienced has a very strong specialization in certifying training programs. We consider that these seven organizations are the perfect partnership to obtain a very successful result. People with intellectual disabilities are going to play a very relevant role in this project. They are the main beneficiaries because they play usually the role as validators. First of all, they are going to answer the survey. It is very important that we gather so many answers from validators as possible in order to build the next steps of the project. Secondly, the project has considered to develop five multiplier events. In these multiplier events, we are going to disseminate the project results. And in these events, we are going to invite people with intellectual disabilities to share their experiences as validators. Finally, in the production of the intellectual outputs, we are also to take into account the opinion of people with intellectual disabilities mainly in the open educational resources, because they are going to play a very relevant role testing and assessing them.